Hello, tanker. Tanks has changed a lot. We had some problems with the matchmaker. Sometimes it didn't work so well. But we fixed it. Now everything's crystal clear. There are always fewer tanks at the top than in the middle or at the bottom of the list. You will always have someone to fight against. No more tagalongs, only single-tier platoons. Now the matchmaker takes vehicle type into account. No more cases of one team having 10 tank destroyers while the other team has none. And if you're at the bottom of the list several times in a row, in the next battle, the matchmaker will try to raise you to the middle or to the top. Map rotation has also improved. The new matchmaker remembers the last 10 maps you've played and tries to find different ones for you for as long as possible. We fixed the artillery. No more one-shots. The damage from SPG has been reduced several times. Instead, it was given stun mechanics. And now, the RD is a true team player and acts as support. To make playing against them more comfortable, the number of SPGs in a battle is limited to three. And first aid kits and repair kits have become reusable. Come and see for yourself. We've got new light tanks in store. We now have Tier 10 light tanks. They have perfect firing characteristics and their battle dynamics are even cooler than that of the legendary T-52. And in general, a lot has changed over the past year. We've got the Swedes, new German tanks, improved vehicle characteristics, improved characteristics for premium vehicles, and new physics and sound. We've got a significantly different interface, and the most important thing is that these improvements are perfectly optimized. FPS hasn't suffered. It actually improved. Come and try the renewed world of tanks.